Hello YouTube, I hope you all are doing well. Today we are going to install Soundflower into OBS. Okay, so you have installed OBS Studio, but there is no desktop audio, only the microphone works. So I'm going to show you how to activate the desktop audio. As you can see, there is no uh, desktop audio at this moment. First of all, you want to download the Soundflower application. This one is for OS X, Mavericks, Yosemite, El Capitan, Sierra and High Sierra. Just the latest uh, version. Okay, so you need to download this file here, the version 2.0b2 DMG. Alright. Let's close up OBS. Once we have downloaded the Soundflower, you want to install it by double clicking on the file. And then you want to double click on soundflower.pkg. Just continue the installation. Enter your extremely secure password. Alright, once the installation was successful, you can close this window. Okay, the next thing you want to do is to go to Utilities, to Applications. You want to scroll down to Utilities. And then you want to double click on Audio MIDI Setup. Alright, and here you have to add, and by clicking on the plus, the Multi Output Device. Just click on that. Here you go, here you want to be sure that you have clicked the first option, which is built-in output. And this option here, which is Soundflower 2-channel. Okay, so built-in output and Soundflower 2-channel. You want to close that. Then you want to go to System Preferences. You want to go to Sound. And here you have to assure that you choose for multi output device all right you want to close this then we are going to start the OBS and from here you want to go to settings you want to disable all the sound options here just go to OK everything is empty now add a scene then you add the source. Let's do uh, display capture. All right. Okay. And then you want to add the in settings. You want to go there. You want to go to audio. And here you want to add the desktop audio to default. Just click on OK. There is the desktop audio and we want to also add the microphone by going to audio and then you go to your microphone. In my case I have a USB microphone. If you have a standard microphone, choose the correct microphone you have. Right? And click on OK. I'll remove the desktop here in this case. And I want to put I want to add desktop and audio just like that okay so now we have microphone and desktop now let's check out if it works if we enable the sound here for example in any YouTube uh, movie now we have desktop audio which is really nice Alright, let's close it. In this video you saw how we can enable the desktop audio in OBS. I hope this video was helpful for you. Later I'm going to upload more videos. Don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you in my next video. For now, stay well, peace out. Rip, 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 rip,